welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I made this display lamp. This lamp is really easy and inexpensive to make and I love the fact that you can change the contents on the inside and change the look of the lamp over time. Today I'm going to give you two ideas on how I decorated mine. Now let's go ahead and get started. To make the lamp, I'm going to be using one of these tall cylinder bases from Dollar Tree and I am going to be using foam board and I am going to be making two circles out of it. After tracing out my circles, I cut them out and I also cut a circle out of this cake board that I bought at Walmart. Then I just used hot glue to glue all of my circles together. Now I am going to be using this rhinestone ribbon that I bought on Amazon and I am going to use it to decorate the bottom of my base as well as the lid. After measuring the ribbon around my base, I am going to cut it and glue it in place. and I will be doing the same thing to my lid. And now as you can see here, the ribbon is much wider than the foam board pieces I had glued and I did that so that this could be the lid for my base. Now I'm going to be using these napkin rings that I bought at Dollar Tree and I am going to be gluing them together using E6000. I wiped off the excess glue before it dried. Then I glued my napkin rings to the center of my lid. I am going to be using this lampshade that I bought at Walmart and I am going to glue it on using E6000. For my lighting I am going to be using one of these LED push lights. You can display anything that you want inside of the lamp. For Christmas I am going to be filling it up with these ornaments. This is how it looked with the ornaments inside. For my second design I am going to make it into a chandelier lamp. I began by cutting a foam board circle that was a bit smaller than the lid. I am going to be using this crystal garland that I bought on Amazon as well as these gemstone stickers that I bought at Walmart. After cutting my garland I am going to be using two gemstones and I am going to be gluing them to the last bead of all of my garland strands. The first strand is 17 beads long and I glued it at the center of the circle. Then I used 5 strands that were 14 beads long and I glued it around that one. Now I am using 5 strands and they are 12 beads long and I am continuing to glue them around the circle. To finish it off I am using 5 strands and this time they are 10 beads long. Once I was done I used double sided tape to place this onto my lamp. And this is how my lamp ended up looking. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I hope you have a wonderful day.